It was described as magical that it would enable it's an entirely new iPhone experience. But has it? It's been a year since we got the Dynamic Island and I was hoping for more. First things first, it's actually really good. The animations look super smooth and it's really handy having your timer count down in the little pill while you're doing other things on your phone. But to live up to its full potential, we're gonna need more third-party apps to start using it. I wanna see things like the status of my food delivery or how many minutes away my bus is. It just really can't do those things yet. Rumors have it that the whole iPhone 15 lineup is going to get the Dynamic Island, so it's reasonable to think that app makers will start using it more, right? Apple has sometimes been known to sacrifice usability for aesthetics. Remember the whole butterfly keyboard? But credit where credit's due. The Dynamic Island manages to do both. It looks really nice and it's pretty useful. It's a step in the right direction. And who knows, maybe one day we'll get a standard messaging protocol. That would be magical, wouldn't it?